Hello everyone, what's poppin? My name is Mr. Akbri and in today's video I will be ranking the three worst maps in Advanced Warfare and I will be ranking the three best maps as well, but I'll do that for another video. There are 13 maps available and I'm not counting the Pipeline remake because, well, it's a remake. <laughs> and um, some of you might agree with me on this and some of you might not. And if you have different opinions on this, just please let me know by leaving a comment with your personal rankings. That's how easy it is. And the way this is going to work is that I'm going to do it in a top three way. So we'll have number three at the beginning, which is the least worst map. And then we'll have number two, which will be worse. And then number one will be the worst. So now that I've cleared that up, let's rank my three worst maps in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Starting with number three, I have to choose Green Pound. <laughs> now this is where some people might not agree with me, and the reason I have this map is because it just doesn't fit well with the movement that we have in this game. I just feel very limited in terms of where to go, because the map is split in so many places, and there are so many places where you can fall, so I always have to worry, and I don't think anybody likes to worry while playing, so... Yeah. Now, visually, I have to say that this map is definitely one of the most beautiful maps made. Moving on to number two, Defender. I feel like this map is just really boring. I'm sorry if someone liked this map. If you do, I'm sorry for saying this, but it's just so plain boring. The atmosphere, the roots, just everything. They're just really boring and standard. You have this circular area in the middle and then the outside is so standard for a Call of Duty game. The only special thing I can think about in this map is the tsunami, that's it. <laughs> now to the worst map in Advanced Warfare, in my opinion. I didn't even have to think about this for a second, to be honest, but it's instinct. It has to be instinct, I mean, it's just a really big jungle, nothing special with this map at all. Personally, I've never really liked maps with a jungle theme that much. Maybe that explains why Defender is uh, in this list as well. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I don't like big maps either, so this map is a combination of two things I don't like. And um, what I don't like the most about this map is the uphill and the downhill areas, which is basically the whole map. <laughs> I prefer to have maps that are flat, kind of. Now, I don't mind having an uphill or downhill at some areas, but this map, the, the whole map is essentially an uphill and then a downhill, so... Yeah, this map is a big no for me. So that's the three worst maps in my opinion. I probably offended someone with this video and if I did, I am truly sorry. That's not my intention at all. This is just all honesty. Again, let me know what your three worst maps are in the comments. The three best maps video will come soon, so stay tuned for that. And until then, I will catch you on the flip side. Bye!